A classic horror story has just been added to Netflix, and if you're considering checking it out, because you know the trailer looked cool, you may want to stick around for the next two minutes. In a classic horror story, five strangers travelling in southern Italy become stranded in the woods, where they must desperately fight to get out alive. This film begins as a very familiar pastiche of several other horror films such as Wrong Turn, Midsommar, The Wicker Man, The Apostle and The Ritual. There are some subtle meta nods in the opening act which will lead you to believe that all of this is intentional and that there will be something clever and modern tying it all together. The characters are all completely forgettable, there is a minimum of effort made with backstory to the point where only two of the five characters are given merely a post-it note's worth of history. And two of the characters are so annoying you'll be willing them to die as soon as possible. The gore is okay. What we do see is fairly grim but there's not a great deal of it and it's often hidden by the camera angle which I found to be pretty lame at times. My issue with this film and it's a big issue. Big issue please, big issue. This is what happens in the last third. There's Jumping the Shark, and then there is the final act of a classic horror story. There are several twists, if you can call them that. The first one, I actually worked out in the first five minutes of the film, and the second, delivered not too long afterwards, is as obvious as it is disappointing and clumsy. But the jumping of the shark does not end there, as the film then goes on to offer several other endings and explanations as to what's going on, none of which make sense all of which are botched in the reveal, and nothing is expanded on to draw the viewer in. And the scene during the end credits had my face contorted in disgust like this. This absolute clunker of a final act is a writer's room whiteboard brainstorming session where everyone's ideas are kept in, including the catering and cleaning lady. A classic horror story? No. My score for a classic horror story is 3 out of 10. Thanks for watching. Game over, man. It's game over. <laughs>